what is up guys, Poncho Cortez, and to all my thick-haired subscribers, I'm going to be kicking off the review with Murray's Black Beeswax. So depending on how long you guys have been subscribed, about a couple years ago I did the yellow beeswax, and to finally follow it up, I'm doing the black beeswax. Now I've been wanting to review this one for some time because it's a lot more different than the yellow beeswax, and you know, I was surprised by it, but you know, not too surprised somewhat. First, the container is an exact opposite of the yellow beeswax. It's just basically a black background with yellow lettering, whereas the other one is just a yellow background with black lettering. So nothing too special there. This is it. If you look inside, this is it. It is stark black. It is very dark. When I was scooping it out, it wasn't too hard. It was pretty easy. As far as rubbing it out in your hands goes, I would recommend having a grease rag handy because you're going to be wiping it in there like crazy and it's just a pain in the ass to really get out and even if you have a little bit left over it's just really for when you have you know extra pomade left over because you don't want to be wearing a white t-shirt you accidentally grab it and then boom you have a lot of pomade on there as far as the scent goes on this pomade it is horrible I would compare it to a Crayola, you know, just your regular children's crayons type of scent because of how waxy it is. They didn't bother or make the effort into making a better fragrance with it, but instead left it as it is. As a result, you smell old, you don't have any anything attractive going for it, and as a result, I had to put on a shit ton of cologne today, and even, I even had a friend that came up to me and he told me, he's like, dude, you know, you smell like a crayon. I'm like, what do you mean? I put on like a bunch of cologne. He says, no, I can smell your hair. So it is really overbearing. As far as application goes and the grip, it's fairly easy. I would recommend putting it in while it's dry because it's an oil-based pomade. If you put it in while your hair is damp or moist, it doesn't help at all and it will deflect. If you look at the grip, it is a medium type grip because I still have hairs that are popping out and so it doesn't hold it down as well. If you know, you're gonna do a hairstyle with this pomade, which you know I doubt any of you should really get this pomade or consider getting it, but you know, I'll get onto the positives later. Really, the issue is, is that it doesn't do enough grip and it's just meant more for a side part or anything else that involves just a you know overlapping hairstyle. I think the only reason why this pomade even exists, it's really meant more as a hair dye for just older gentlemen who have gray hairs or white hairs and wanna look youthful again. I could see this being the only reason why it still exists, although I do know Murray's is really a African American uh, hair company, so that might be a reason too. I'm not sure why, if you guys have any ideas, you know, just comment below. But like I said, I think that's really why it is. It's meant more just to dye your hair and to give it a darker tint just to look youthful again. My hair normally looks dark, but because it's a light brown, you can definitely see the brown sometimes. In here, it looks very black. I mean, I will have to admit, I do like the shine and the fact that it is really dark because I think having dark hair is, in, is pretty cool. It's, it pops out a lot more and it helps if you want to really show off that sheen. As far as washing out goes, it's a pain in the neck because it is a petroleum beeswax blend, so it's going to take at least a couple days. Definitely use some hardcore uh, conditioner, apply it on there like crazy, and hopefully it will get out within the next two days. It's not that bad. I wouldn't recommend putting in too much, like definitely use about three scoops. Like I said, this is really more of those products that's used for older gentlemen because Morgan's pomade has the exact same pomade like it where it's super dark but it's just meant more for a senior citizen. Overall though guys, I personally was not crazy about this pomade. I was really disappointed. I was at least hoping for a better scent. If not, you know, just because it's a pain in the ass to work with as it is. And so why throw on a terrible scent? Thanks for watching guys. Like, share, and subscribe. Crews longer than anticipated to find the crack in the 64-year-old pipeline. I'm standing here with Fred, who says he was greatly impacted by the gushing of oil. Can you tell us a little more of what you saw? I sure can. I was sitting on my front porch, grabbed a beer, and fuck her right in the pussy. Back to